Hello, little geese buds. How are you? I missed you. I don't know what species of geese those are, but they are kind of weird. Isn't that a geese? A gooses? A gaggle? They don't look as happy to see me as I am to see them, but uh, yeah, that right there is some open water. But this right here, it's about eight, nine inches, so it should be good. Let's get after it and stuff. What is going on, you dirty old stash geeses? It is me, it is Jordan, and it is Colt, Cody. Coming down eventually, he's still sleeping. We're gonna try to find him though, but yeah, this season has been real weird. Worst weather for an ice season I have ever seen in my entire life. Not that I'm that old, but I've been ice fishing for like 15 years. This is strange. We're having like 60s, 65s, 55s, after having 20 inches of snow, negative 20s, it's just been wild. It's been hard to uh, get out a whole lot. It's kind of sucked, but when we have got out, we've done pretty good. And uh, yeah, been doing a lot of channel cat stuff. I did ice camp the other day for 32 hours straight for walleyes. You guys won't see that unless you check out Jordan's channel. Check out Jordan's channel, he made a video. He caught some, we caught some. They were just tiny and I did a poor job of recording. I had fun getting a little more diet on that ice camping. Hopefully be doing that soon. But today we are going for catfish again for the catfish haters, my favorite thing to do. But we're going for the largest catfish in North America, the blue cat. After some floods, the river trapped a couple in this pond. And uh, luckily, thanks to uh, old Col Colt, Cody, we have uh, permission to fish it. It's not gonna be easy though. Last time it took two days to catch a couple and uh, we did end up catching a 48-13, which is giant. And yeah, still haven't got a 10 inch auger working on it, trust me. Not sure if a 10 inch auger would really even help here. Though. So, yeah, come along with us. Gotta get some craps or some bait. Set up a lot of dip ups. Hopefully, rip a big stuff and things. Pa, pa. Oh, old K drill. How I don't miss you. I've just ran this thing into too much junk, I think. It's not working like it used to. We're gonna have to put her down once we get a 10 inch auger. Thing is a piece of shit, Jordan. That took like 30 seconds. Wild. You already got one? Easy enough. My lure might be a little bit too big for the crappies, but there's... Yeah, there's a lot. It's a lot of bait down there, Jordan. Lots of bait. Crappy. Good enough. We don't need much. Everyone gets mad that we use. My crappy bigger than your crappy? Everyone gets mad that we use crappies for bait, but honestly, this dude is gonna make headpiece for uh, for a tip up. And then we just use little inch, 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 inch. I mean, 20 pieces of bait for a crappie? At least 15. So for anybody who thinks that we're weird for using crappie for bait, it's legal. And we get a lot of a lot of pieces of bait off of this crappie. And as you can see on the screen, there's plenty of crappies in here. Alrighty. Well, uh, Colt made it down and he's going back up. He's gonna go get me a Capri Sun. Sound good. Asked me if I wanted one. I said, hail. Yeah. Also shout out to Colt because that was Prairie Dog and let me use his bathroom. Pretty nice having a bathroom pretty close by and we got all the traps set pieces of crappie i fish pros jaw jackers tip ups we got a lot of them out but we're still under the legal limit and yeah it's just a waiting game like i said at the beginning this is not easy this doesn't happen fast they're smart they do eat in the winter they are moving around and even though it's just a little tiny pond you think they would be pretty brain dead they they're absolutely not brain dead so yeah, catch up with Colt, find a place to jig, and 
hopefully get a big. See you soon. And stuff. I think it's spinning. Yeah, spinning. Spinning fast. It's hauling ass. Got it. Almost spooled the whole thing. Seems kind of small though, but it damn near spooled it. First tip up fish of the year. Look at how much line is left on mine. Almost got it all. You see it? No, look at the spool. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hellfire Farms. That didn't take long. No, it didn't. Really doesn't seem big, but we need a little warm up fish. Oh, yeah. He's Is he? Yeah. Blue? Yeah. Is it already? I think so. Yeah. Like a 15, maybe? 15, 20. Maybe 20. Yeah, that's a reasonable one. Hell yeah. Dude, it was dumping line. Yeah, I haven't seen one move that fast since last time you we were here, I guess. Oh, wow. Yeah. Guess what that one was on, Colt? White perch. The only one that has white perch on it. White perch head. Blue cat. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hellfire Farms. You happen to have pliers on you? It's probably... I should have actually brought mine down because it looks like he done ate it. Jordan, I got it! Jordan, I got it! Okay. Colt, how many blues have we caught through the ice? I think only caught five last year, maybe? Five total. What time is it now? Pretty early. Time for another one. I'd say it's an upper teener. Good old big channel cat sized blue cat. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. Hopefully you boys got your running shoes on. I think we're going to have to do some running. And we also might have to do some drilling if this guy doesn't figure his life out here. Look, that's a small one and it barely wants to come, come out or go hit back in the hole. Those little arms, man. Sometimes they just beep. You don't want to break them, but... Luckily that one just went in, but I think every time we run to a flag we need pliers and a drill. Yeah. And an auger. And let's some more some Capri Suns. And some more Capri Suns. <laughs> and stuff. Capri Sun time. We had a Capri Sun in years. We got fruit punch. Spinning. You go, run. Jordan, we got a flag. Oh, still kinda. Oh, it's falling ass, Cody. <laughs> All right, pull it up slowly. Just pull the whole thing up slowly and then grab the line. And then just a quick jerk. Did you get him? Yeah, you got him. Here, I'll take that. Hell yeah. Took a second, a few false flags in between. It looks kind of good, doesn't it? You definitely feel them. Not bad. Bigger? Looks Bigger yet? A little darker. I think we, I don't know if he is either. Yeah, and that's 50 pound fluoro. As long as his fins come in. Blues bite down real good. Oh yeah. oh yeah, you got a glove? No. And if we need to drill another hole so we don't break his fins, we easily can. Oh. Out. Yeah. Yeah. He needs another hole. Yeah. We're gonna have, yeah, that's like a 30, ain't it? 25? That's a nice little fish. All right, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to let him swim free for a while. 10 inch hole it wouldn't even help this guy so he's hooked good just let him run whatever direction he wants 
and then we're just gonna have to drill some more he's definitely he's that way so I'd probably drill one where I am yep you're safe there Before you go through, stop. Nope, he's still good. You're good. Oh. Broke off. Oh! No. No. That's all right. I thought he was good, but I felt... Did you see that jerk? I did. Damn. I felt it. I felt it all the way back there. That's okay. It's better than hurting the fish. Now he's got some line in him though. And now this one doesn't have a leader on it, but I'm sure I can figure that out. I thought he was good. That was a good fish too. 30. Did you get a good picture of his face? I did, we saw his face. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well finish the hole. I'm gonna try to figure out a leader and then we'll just have a double hole on this one because it seems to keep going off. But it's all right. it happens, man. That's a part of the deal. That's why last year with that big Hog Daddy, it was so special to be able to actually that's get That's why them dudes are talking shit. They're like, man, he made me cringe with the reader. And it's like, you don't think it's hard sitting there with the auger? Trying yeah, to we're cringing too. <laughs> we're like, this is terrible. Yep, just a little Nicky. Here we go. Instant. Instant breakage. Hey, there's action though. He'll that, be back. Hopefully we do get that one back. Oh yeah. That get was the, a trouble, huh? Yeah. Not great for the fish. Oh shit, another flag. I gotta go. I love you, bye. Alright, love you, bye. Another flag. I figured I'd just go for it before he dropped it. Tiny. Blue though. Kind of mangy, but yeah, blue enough. You came back and we got one. <laughs> yeah, that's about. <laughs> we might have to put him out of his misery, eh? Hey guys. <laughs> yeah. Hey friends. Yeah, come on, you don't want to. What the? Oh, yeah. You ever? See... I've never seen that fish in my life. <laughs> I'm not even sure if he can straighten out. Oh, looks it like, looks like a mist and it looks like another blue bit him right here. It looks like he's deformed. Definitely deformed. Nuts. He wasn't about to die in an hour. Yeah. Barely fit in his weird little mouth. You better put that in there for him so <laughs> Yeah, I better feed him. Come here, friend. Dude, like he won't Oh, he's, he's got like a deformity in his tail. Is he dead? <laughs> Did I kill him? Maybe that was the last hurrah for him. Oh, no, he went. Did he go? Yeah, his tail didn't move. It was like, Arr! holy shit. He's like one of them critters where just, <laughs> the body drags behind him and he just. <laughs> <laughs> that was wild. I've never seen that fish in my life. That. He probably never will again. Yeah, he looks unless like he, he looks floats like up on shore. He looks like he's going through it. That's the most unhealthy fish I've ever seen in this lake. Holy shit! That was disgusting. Is it a blue cut? Nice. Didn't have to reel much. No. How sh is it the same one? Is it this? It's the same one? Dude, we gotta quit picking on that guy. Yeah. De definitely. What a what a bad day for Bud, man. He's just trying to get some food, and here we are. Watch, he's gonna turn into some 60 pound hero in <laughs> 10 years, and he got, we're gonna see his tail. Moved a little bit. Did he fight real hard? No. But I was like slowly walking over. And I did see it was up, and all of a sudden it went like that. I was like, oh shit. He got hit with that treble hook and that jaw jack, and he was like, oh.
Um, I'm did. just gonna play dead. You don't want to put him on the. Um, you don't want to put him on the interweb. <laughs> yeah, he's going on there at least hey once. Hey guys, <laughs> I'm here. Hey guys, I like white perch. <laughs> no hungry. Feed me. I mean, he couldn't have caught a better one than that. It's downhill from here. That is the pinnacle, Jordan. Oh my god. Giant. Big one, I think. That thing was hauling ass. Absolutely hauling, man. No, I wish. Let me get the drill. Yeah, let's use Jordan's this time though. His goes faster. Drill. Oh, I think it's big. It's at least decent. It might fit. Definitely a blue. If he keeps his fins down, we'll be good. He's doing it. Oh, we got it? Yep, got it. <laughs> when I stopped it though, it felt like a damn freight train. Dude, they're like biting each other. That one had, that's definitely catfish bite mark. I bet you that's a flathead. Big old. Jesus, it's huge. Coo coo, coo coo ka choo. All right, blue number three and a half. Four. Four. We got the same one twice. <laughs> and then we also had the bad incident of the drill doing drill things. Colt's got a call, but let's get this one back. Able to get the hook out. All right, there we go. Definitely has some bite marks from other fish on him. It's a rough life in here. Rough life. What time is it, boys? Noon? Yep. 11.58. 11.58. Got a few. A little bit more action than last year, so. We'll keep it going. We were maybe going to go to another lake, but I think this is too much fun. We'll stay here. And stuff. Flags got to start flying soon, don't they? Hopes and dreams. Hopes and dreams. Uh -huh. Jordan. <laughs> Waiting for a whole big boy to come back. Who <laughs> did they don't pay for me? They <laughs> don't pay for me. I bet if we put on some fresh bait, we could at least catch him again. <laughs> I think at least 95% of these are carp. Just by how they're acting. There's also some Chadleys up high. Look at those boogers. I didn't think there was any more in here. Those certainly look like Chadley's to me. I could be wrong though. And they could be crappy too. Yeah. Seems like they really hang tight to the cover here. I can see why. Every time they get away from, oh Reel my pole in, that's bent as My pole is still in. <gasps> yep, blue cat. No. I don't think it's a giant one, but it is one. Or it's just a bigger channel, but something happened, boys. Yeah. I didn't even hear it. I didn't either. I just looked over and it was like bent still, but uh-huh. He's already here. He's got some pretty wicked head shakes though. Hell yeah. Oh, son, the up again. Hell yeah. Look at that big old Alabama blue cat coming through the <laughs> ice. <laughs> it is a blue, isn't it? It has to be. Oh, son, the <laughs> Hell yeah. Is he going to fit, though? As long as he puts his fins down, I think he's another, like, 15-er. Much different experience on the rod though, I'll tell you that for free. See, so got that like way down, bubbling. 
Did he swallow the dang gyro? Oh, no, it's back out. Be careful without travel. We should be able to get him. He's a schmedium boy. That's a good one. Not bad. Not a freak show, but not bad. Still a fish on the G row. Blue kitty. Yeah. Spinner Bob. Hill. Yeah. I bet he will. They've been a little bit nicer than the channel cats at putting their fins down. Just gotta give it a couple goes. Hell yeah. Same too. <laughs> we just need to <laughs> Oh, I know you don't want to go move them, Jordan, but I think yours needs some adjusting. I put all new bait on. I'm talking about location. You could squeeze one in here if you're feeling ballsy. All I know is I need some more guts. Because white perch guts drive me nuts. Hail, yeah. And stuff. Oh, yeah. That seems tiny. No? Another schmedium boy. On the old pink pole. I didn't even like reel my pole in. I just started running with it. And once it got out of the hole, I dropped it. <laughs> Marie does that all the time. <laughs> <laughs> starts running with it. Well, definitely a lull, but we'll fish till dark. Yeah. We're catching more. Oh yeah, a little tight. Blue kitty though? Yeah. 10 pounder? Seriously? Oh, come on, he's 10. Eh, maybe not. He's doing the fin thing, even though he's a little guy. Kind of skinny. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Early. I wonder if the crappies are just too big for fish like this to eat. Looks like a little shark. Mm -hmm. Look how tall that thing's top fin is. Mm -hmm. Wild. They've been a little bit more cooperative than the channels though. Might jinx it with this one though. He looks pretty erect. <laughs> We're going. Your jaw jacker is going off next, Jordan. I swear. I can feel it. What did you like put on your hands this morning, Jordan? Lotion. <laughs> did you? Did, Never do that again. I know, clearly. I like even wash my hands with white perch. You scrubbed slime on your hands? Yep. My secret to catching catfish through the ice, Jordan, is the whole season I never wash my bibs, I never take a shower, I never put lotion. <laughs> you smell me? I'm ready for these bibs to be gone. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. And gals. Remember when I said blue cat fishing through the ice was a very hard thing to do at the beginning of this video? Well, this is the end of day two. It is two o'clock. We got here at seven and absolutely nothing happened today. Yesterday was pretty good though. The flags were flopping, we were running, and I'm kind of out of shape or something because my legs hurt and I'm kind of sore from chasing flags, but we did pretty good yesterday. We got the one weird one. We actually got it twice. And um, yeah, we screwed up the first fish through the ice this year, over 20, guarantee it was over 20. It might've even been 30. You had the big old thick 
succulent 25 to 35 pound fish but yeah blue cats are the biggest cats in north america but they're also one of the hardest to catch through lies more of a southern fish they do like cold i don't get it i don't know saw them all day they're buyers buyer baits all day and we just couldn't catch them but we did catch some if you like this video give this video a thumbs up leave a comment subscribe this ice season's weird i'm gonna keep pushing the limits but obviously not past the limits of safety because yeah it's getting kind of sketchy it's 55 today and it's not even february yet our ice season started january 1st and it's still january now and i'm already talking about things going I i'm gonna cry if i keep talking about it but thanks for watching not sure what i'm gonna do next but i'm gonna try to find something try to find something safe try to find something safe.